In this video, I'm going to explain to you how you can navigate the Files app and how you can use it to download any texture pack or behavior pack you want for both iOS and Minecraft Preview. The links for everything used can be found in the description. The first thing you want to do is find a texture pack. There are two good websites for this. There's mcpel.com and Bedrock Tweaks. So I'm going to be downloading a resource pack from both websites to demonstrate how easy it is to download things. So I'm just going to download um, this Black Nether Bricks texture pack. Now in here you can name it, so you can name whatever you want. Name, name, poop. You know, so you can download whatever you want. So we can download that. Let's press download, and then it's gonna pop up in our downloads folder. Then let's go over to this one, and let's download this one, and make sure we're downloading for the correct version. So these minor versions of 0 0.5, 0 0.4, 0 0.30, story count, so we're just gonna press here. I'm not a robot. Select all the images for the bus. and download. And we can see that uh, they're both in our downloads folder. So now we're gonna exit out of Safari or whatever browser you're using to download the texture packs. And we're gonna navigate to our files app and resource pack and our name name poop. Now double tapping on one of them, let's just start this one here, was going to launch Minecraft and may launch directly to preview for you. If that is the case, I will quickly show you how you can solve that problem. But first, let's just make sure, see what happens, import started, and then you're gonna get the uh, successfully imported. Now, if it says for you, unsuccessful import, go back into your files app, and you're just gonna select the other one, and we're going to move, and we're just going to move it to on iPad or on your phone, go to Minecraft, go to games, com.mojang, and then we wanna go to our resource packs folder right here. And then we're just gonna hit copy. So then we're gonna go navigate to there, Minecraft, games, com.mojang, resource packs and then we're going to see our cubic resource packs we're going to open it from there and it should refresh minecraft and we should get a successful import import started successfully imported our texture pack so now if we head back over to here you can see that we now have two different folders that have been created so now let's make sure that these new texture packs works and how to use them so we're just going to create a new world and they are updating the new ui with these screens so you should have something that looks like this so we're going to go head over to resource packs and we're going to go to active and we're going to see that we have none activated right now. So we're going to go to available, owned, and we're going to find the two that we just installed. So we're going to have QBQI, we're going to press activate, and we have our name name poop, and we're going to make sure we activate that one. So if we scroll back up to active, you can see that there are two texture packs activated. And this is going to create this new world and make sure that it loads in correctly. Okay, so now we can see in our new world, we can see that we have our, our hotbar looks very different. So now if we just take a look at some black nether bricks, we could be able to see that they look different. So as you can see, all the new nether brick blocks are black with this texture pack on. So if you were having a problem with the resource pack directly installing to Minecraft preview instead of the game itself you wanted to play on, just go over to the resource pack you want and select it. And then you want to scroll down to open a new window. And then right next to where it says open to Minecraft, it probably says open to Minecraft preview for you. You're going to want to hit those that uh, box with the arrow on it. And then you're gonna scroll over to where it says Minecraft. But for this instance, I'm gonna show you how you can properly install it in Minecraft Preview. So you wanna make sure you wanna select Minecraft. And I'm gonna hit Minecraft Preview just to demonstrate. So make sure you wanna go to, to edit, and then we're gonna go to our resource packs, available, cubic, activate, active, make sure it's there. And we're gonna load it up. So as you can see, we have the cubic UI texture pack installed on this world. And oh God, what are these? buttons anyway if you like what you see remember to like and subscribe if you have any issues remember to leave a comment or you can join my discord which is linked in the description you can ask for any help there now if you want to know how to use texture packs using the old ui which you might still have click on this uh video that's like right here right in the screen right there just tap it